Olympic Games in Tokyo 2020 next year. Top six wrestlers all advancing to represent their country in Tokyo. Final bronze medal match, the Greco-Roman style. Blue push. Georgia in the red, Germany blue. in the blue. A lot of pressure here from the beginning from Pope. Almost pushing Kashayo to the zone. Here with an underhook. Jaya still has the underhook on the right side of the body of Pope. Pope being very careful. Trying to slip his right arm free. And Ajaya just never really got comfortable with that underhook, any opportunity to throw, so they go back to a stalemate. Fresh start, a little more than a minute into this first period. Nothing happening right now, Georgia, Germany. A lot of positional wrestling, a lot of adjustments here. Both wrestlers trying to get in. To position. And the Georgian wrestler with the first opportunity with Pater. Looking to score on Pope. Contact. Tight, tight grip here. Pope defending. A lot of movement. Takes a lot to turn Pope. Does Hajaya have a lot? Still with that grip. Tries to get that momentum barreled over, and Pope goes tumbling across. But no exposure, so no points. Boy, that was close. Very close call. Blue, red, finger. Hajaya settles for one on top in parterre. Two minutes in, first period. Pope really stepping up here, putting, applying pressure, stepping up the pace a bit. Back into the center of the mat. Hajaya is able to gear his work toward. Throughout the years, Edward Pope has won a lot of two to one matches. Gives up the early passivity. He'll hope to get that passivity back in the second period. So big, so strong, it's just tough to move. Very tough to move and very tough to get, get an underhook, get into that position. Pope controlling center mat right now. Whistle stops the action with 13 seconds to go in this opening period. Don't forget gold medal coming up, Turkey, Cuba. Rizakaya out, Oscar Pino Hines. All the contrasting styles at heavyweight are a finale on this Tuesday night in Nur Sultan. Russia has won the team title. The Russian Federation defends their championship from a year ago. They did it in a little bit of a different way. Not the, the complete dominance that we saw last year at the Worlds. Certainly an effective formula with their depth and a lot of different wrestlers scoring. Georgia in contention to play second. Ajayla trying to do his part with the Georgian contingency. Period two, Pope and Ajaya. Still 100% open match here. Pope wants to do enough. In the back of his mind, he wants a chance to get that point back on parterre. So he's going to try to push it. We'll see him be pretty active with his hands, looking to get some setups, whether it's the hands, the wrists, the under hooks. Something to show the official that he's trying to score. The verbal warning given to Georgia as far as action goes. Now Pope wow. loses his balance. Ajaya jumps on top, has that reverse grip. Quad pod type position. Still has that reverse grip. 
Ajaya is going to try to thrust them up and over. <laughs> Good luck at doing that, but he will settle around for two, and Hajaya goes up 3-0. That's a big moment in this match. Pope not known for his big offense. That is a big moment, and Kajai really going here for the close in the match, not leaving it up to the referees, the judges, with a 5-0 to zero lead. Blue. Blue. Caution was given to Pope underneath. So that's two more for Hajaya. Hajaya will get the option to work on top. And now Edouard Pope's in some trouble. Hajaya has opened it up a little bit. The two and then the two on the caution and a 5 nothing lead. Big jerk there, moved the body of Pope. A jerk to try to establish the grip, those hands underneath the belly button of Pope right now. And unable to go anywhere with it, we go to the feet. This will be interesting to see Pope, how he's adjusting to this. Needs to get into position, looking to score big. Two countries who have had multiple medal winners coming down to at 130. Georgia with a 5 0 lead. Hajala. Attention, blue. And he had that feeling before Hajaya secured the takedown that Pope was maybe only four, five seconds away from getting his parterre call. Which Kajaya probably sensed as well and did the only thing he could. Scored enough points, not leaving it up to the judges. Giving them a chance to do the Pacific call. And Pope is in a position now, he needs to score big. This is really, really a challenge here for Pope to get under, to get in a position. Kashaya is staying active. Not shying away, not giving away. He's staying centered. Head up red, head up blue. Pope going at it. 10 seconds to go. The 2016 Olympian from Georgia, Jacoby Hajaya, caps off what was a great week of wrestling by Georgia. Multiple medal winners, a position to play second in the world behind Russia. And Hajaya takes down the tall and giant German, a final of 5 nothing.